Yeah, well, I'll tell you, that doghouse was heavier than any tombstone. And that doghouse pretty much was the tombstone. Uh, you sounds like you're fucking with me now. I am not. I am being very honest with you, sir. I, I'm telling you I the honest truth from my from my sound mind and start, my sound heart. I'm 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 starting to I'm starting to really kind of doubt this whole honesty thing you you keep talking about. I mean, how, how do you think? I mean, how do you think Casey would feel if you know if I if I told if I told about this? You know, I, I, what, what what do you think she how how do you think she would feel about you know you comparing this whole lifting a 30, 50 pound doghouse to, you know, maybe a hundred, 200 pound, you know, tombstone. And that doghouse was probably dog what, made of wood. And this is, no, this it, was solid was, rock. No. I mean, I'll tell you, yeah, this is both wood and plastic. That thing had to weigh over a hundred pounds. Plastic's pretty light, you know. I mean, that's. I'm sorry. This is, this is, this isn't, this isn't even close to the same. I mean, and that's just, and that's just that. I mean, you, I, you know, if you if you had told this to Casey, she would probably be, uh, she would be, she would be so angry. I mean, you're just totally grasping at straws at this point. Yeah, well, also, I've been to a whole bunch of this, also, to go off, talk about, off topic a bit, or going back to an old topic, that I have been deceived by the trolls. A bunch of them pretended to be women who I thought were honest over the internet when I was talking to them for the first time for a while. Who and, gives and a I shit even, about the and, internet? And some, of them, and, and some of them were actually, and some of them were actually Be a true man. And those, two, and those two women died. I was very, I was very heartbroken by that. And yet, I was even more heartbroken. Like, I don't even I know the these people. I, I, I may not have met. Okay, well, yeah. I, wait, wait. That. Did you say they were fake women? You say did you say that these women were fake? You said, so, so wait. These women were probably fake. Fake women died. I didn't. These aren't I didn't no, I'm talking about no. Two of them. You know, a couple, a few of them were real women. And how many of oh, these I, women have you gone through? I have not been able to go to them. But, I mean, but, once, but there was this one time where I actually thought it was a woman. I actually drove a whole, a whole, drove a whole day's worth back and forth, almost 24 hours, to from my house to Cleveland, Ohio. Well, it turns out that that was a that was a bad lead. I drove a whole, I drove a whole, almost 20. I drove from five in the morning to 12 o'clock to about. Just after the after midnight, to find Wait, but, the, the destination was a bad one, and that was that was an imposterous troll. So you went to go to Ohio for a fake woman, but my Casey just told but me I, that I, you I, won't I, go I, and visit I, her, I, I, a I, real I, woman. I, I mean, I'm I'm looking night. at Casey right now, but and you wouldn't the, go to you wouldn't go to D.C. That's like two hours away. And you've met her before, for God's sake. Yeah, well, I mean, I was more naive. I was more naive back then, but I am very less naive now. I have been very less naive for about for about a year now. I am not convinced. Oh, come on! You should come be on. <laughs> Do you know who you're? T <laughs> you know who you're talking to, son. What the fuck is this? I mean, you, you're, now you're just you're just talking back to me like a little kid. Don't yell at me, you maggot! Piece of shit. Yeah. Well, you talk. You're obviously talking to me like as if I was a child, and I am not. Because you child. are a child. You're acting like a child. I am not a child. I am a man. I am a strong man. I have been through a whole bunch of emotional and physical traumas in my life. You you haven't proven a thing to me. You've shown me nothing that could even possibly no. suggest that you well, are a man. Well, sometimes my memory fails me. 
You're just sitting around in your parents' house, crying about your little dog, playing video games, whining about women on the internet. Some lazy little. Maggot. I am not. I am not lazy. You're living with your parents and you don't have a job. How is that not lazy? Well, maybe maybe I don't have a job, but I do work around the house. I That's left a whole chores. bunch of I do those every day, and I'm retired. And they're not just chores. I, they're not just chores. Yes, they are. Everyone works around the house. Maybe everyone works around the house, but they don't. But they differ from burden to burden to heavy weights. I mean, you, and, I mean, and yes. I've seen, and and you know, I I look, I was looking around that YouTube. I saw a video of your house. It's a fucking mess. You call that working around the house? I, well, I mean, are you trying to be some, and you're trying to be some kind of house husband or something? Well, most of that mess belongs to my mother, and I can't really move. I can't really organize it without her being able to help me, without her being able to point out where to put everything. Now it's your mom's fault, and it, that's that's real mature. <laughs> she's a, well, yeah, okay, well, yeah, I admit she's a bit of a pack rat, and since she retired from secretarial work, she's been a little bit more lazy. I'll admit that. And your room, but your room was a mess too. What do you have to say about that? I mean, this is this is nothing. I I mean. Yeah, at this it rate, you're, nothing, you're not getting. May, uh, you're a pack nothing. rat too. I am not a. I am not that bad of a pack rat. I mean, I even I even brought a bunch. I even brought practically all that stuff into the house, and I had to bring in a couch, and I had to bring in the hutch, among other pieces of furniture, among the smaller pieces of the smaller bunches of junk that my mom got. That's a lot. That's a lot of heavy lifting, and it was very have to hard. Push furniture. I mean, all this stuff you're talking about, this heavy burden, sounds like stuff everybody has to do at least some point. You know, maybe every while. This is not. I mean, this is just regular everyday housework. This isn't real work. This is chores. Oh, you know, this is and you kids don't think, stuff. Oh, and you don't think carrying your carrying your soldier friend on your back was a heavy was a heavy burden. That was a heavy that's, burden. What the fuck is it? Are you mocking me? I am not mocking I mean, you. Are you? I mean, you're, you're, did I'm you, you compare? That, I'm just pointing out that what you did was a heavy burden on yourself. I don't even know what to say to this. Yeah, I mean, I mean that, I, is, a, I, yeah, I, that it, is a heavy burden because you were fighting to save a, you were fighting to save your friend's life. Casey, I mean, come on, come over here. You, you got to listen to this. Listen to this guy. This is great. What, what daddy? Uh, just, just, uh, what is, I mean, <laughs> I mean, this guy, this guy's just Daddy, fucking. Daddy, you sound mad. What's wrong? This guy's just fucking with me. He's not even, I mean, he's not even respecting me at all. He's disrespectful. Why I don't he's know. disrespecting you? What is he doing? I don't know. He's just talking about this little faggot kitty shit. And how he has to move chairs and do, oh no. Housework. I mean, and he's comparing that, you know, to when your to when your grandma died. He's what? Yeah, I mean, I mean, he's he's talking about these heavy burdens he's had to face, you know, and he's he's you know saying it's you know it's a heavy burden, kind of like when Grant, you know, you remember? Well, of course you remember when when we lost grandma. How oh would you forget? Oh my God! I know. I had to volunteer just to get my mind off it. I mean, and this guy, this guy has nothing to offer you. I have a lot to offer her. Really? I have well, plenty to offer her. Well, like don't don't let my father like, like that. You need to respect him. He's a retired <laughs> Marine. I, I do respect your father, Casey. Well, you need to be nice to him. What are you going to do if he doesn't like you? Uh, I, I mean, I, wa I was being nice to him, but then... He started to insult me. He was talking down to me like as if I was a child when I'm an adult. I already Chris, don't like him. He's way older than you. He's your elder. To him, you are a child. I'm a child to him. 